Rusty digs in. That's weird. Where in the world are they? I don't get it. A bunch of my tools and inventions are missing. Have you guys seen where they went? And a bunch of my stuff is gone, too. It doesn't make sense. My gecko wall climbing gloves were right here. And my eco rocket boots were right there. Well, at least my sandwich is where I left it. <gasps> oh, no. It's gone, too. What is going on around here? Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess that explains where all our stuff went. I'm glad you like the drill attachment I made for your tail, Bodasaur. But do you have to bury everything? Uh, no thanks. You keep it. It's cool if you bury things, but can you not bury our stuff? You promise? Good, because we have important stuff to do today. Check this out! Wow! You finished making the Super Citizen Medal for Mr. Higgins. Awesome work, Rusty. Thanks, Ruby. I can't wait till he gets it at the big ceremony this afternoon. He's here! Hey, kids. Hey, Mr. Higgins. Ready for your big day? Oh, boy. I hope so. Do I look okay? <laughs> <laughs> you look great. But you may have forgotten one thing. What? <gasps> I'm so excited for the Super Citizen Ceremony that proper footwear slipped my slippery mind. It's a good thing your award isn't based on what you wear on your feet. It's about all the amazing things you've done. <laughs> I wouldn't say I've done anything worthy of all this celebration hullabaloo. Are you kidding? You're the town's very first inventor and an inspiration to everyone, especially me. Just think of all the amazing things you've invented. The reverse umbrella to help speed up bath time. Or when you solve the banana shortage with your auto banana briefcase. And of course, the day you opened your shop. Our town hasn't been the same since. Aw, thanks, Omegaton kids. Now, if I'm gonna get my shoes before the big shindig, I'd better get hopping. <laughs> so long! We'd better get to the ceremony, but first, let's grab. Mr. Higgins' medal! <gasps> it's gone! Uh, Rusty? So is Bodasaur. Oh no! What if he buried it in the yard? We've got to find him. Bodasaur, where are you? Here, boy, Bod- Whoa! Whew! Thanks. No problem. <laughs> hey, Bodasaur, did you take Mr. Higgins' medal and bury it somewhere? <laughs> you don't know. We don't have enough time to check all these holes. Hmm. So if we can't go to Mr. Higgins' metal, maybe we can bring it to us. We just need a really strong magnet to get through all that dirt. Sounds like a job for our super powerful electromagnet. If that metal is out there, this magnet will bring it to us. Let's crank it to full power. flying around up there, did you? <laughs> what are we going to do? It's almost time for the ceremony. I know, but the meadow's not in the yard. It could be buried. Hmm. Anywhere in town. Mr. Higgins' medal ceremony starts soon. And we've got no medal. Done. We've got a new way to find Mr. Higgins' medal, and here it is. Woo! A metal detector. 
With it attached to your buggy, we can search all over town in no time. Time to bolt. <laughs> like you buried half the town. <laughs> Any luck with the metal detector? Nothing yet. But I like the sound of that beeping. Old tin cans. Some busted car parts. Hmm, nothing but junk. Are you sure you can't remember where you buried it? <laughs> 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 It's just a bird. Why is the metal detector detecting him? <gasps> the metal! That pesky seagull took it! So, you didn't take it after all, did you, Bodasaur? Mm -hmm. I should have known you wouldn't break your promise. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Presentation oh. because the Super Citizen Medal is 
in my hands right now. Come on up here, Mr. Higgins. I proudly present to you the Spartan Hills Super Citizen Medal. You want to say a few words? Of course, Ranger Anna. I'd be thrilled to say a few words. Words such as huckleberry, plop, shampoo, and of course, thank you. Way to go, Mr. Higgins. Heroes come in all sizes. And when you have a dino-sized hero, you need a dino-sized medal. Bodasaur, this is for you. For service above and beyond. I think I know what he wants. Me too. It's your medal, Bodasaur. You can do anything you want with it. <laughs> Even if that means burying it. Rusty's brave cave save. Really? I'm serious, Rusty. I'm talking about super strong armored creatures everywhere. Really? Yep, I've seen them with my own eyes. They're really tiny, but can do big things. They can lift this real arm. Like this? Uh, yeah. And you're saying these creatures are right here in the yard? Yep. Wanna see? Whoa, cool ant farm, Liam. Thanks. This one's name is Archer, and that's Aziz. Adrian, Alicia, you've named them all? Yep. Look at Annalisa go. Rusty, you ready yet? We gotta meet Sammy at Planner's Peak. Ready. I just finished the modifications on these robo arms. I can't wait to explore the caves. Caves? Cool, I love caves. Can we come too? For sure, Liam. And ants. Yes! Check out some caves. Oh, yeah. Okay, first, some safety tips. Number one, the cave entrance is super steep, so it's important. <laughs> Who knew safety could be so much fun? Sammy, are you okay? I think. I, I think I have ants in my pants. <laughs> Idea. Guys, this cave is a lot darker than I thought. Help! Hey, maybe we can squeeze through that small hole. Hang tight, Sammy. We found a way in. 
did you invent a shrinking machine, Rusty? Cause we're too big to fit in that hole. Everyone, stand back. I've got this. Uh, I... <sighs> I have a very big head. That's okay. It was worth a shot. I think this is a job for someone a little smaller. Let's get some bits on the fix. Ray, Crush, we're in a squeeze and need your help. <laughs> Sammy's trapped down in the cave, but we can't fit through the opening to help him. Ray, he'll need some light. And Crush, Sammy could use some snacks. You guys hang out with Sammy while we move this rock out of the way. You know, maybe this cave isn't that scary. Ah! Cave monster thing! Yikes! Uh. Ray? Crush? <laughs> I knew it was you guys. <laughs> you brought snacks? You're the best. I hope Rusty can get us out of here soon. Okay, Rob. Time to roll. Let's pull that boulder out of there. On three. One, two, three. Step on it. for plan C. There you go, Amber, Angie, and Al. Home sweet home. If we can't move the boulder from the entrance, we'll have to find another way in. Maybe there's another opening. But how are we gonna get to it? Easy, we climb. Not so easy. If only I had uh, longer arms. <sighs> You do have longer arms. Back at the yard. Remember your robo arms? That's right. Good thinking, Liam. Potasaur, how fast can you get my robo arms here? Potasaur? Wow! Pretty fast. Good boy, Potasaur. Time to climb. Nope. How about you? Do you see a way in? I found an opening. If one of us was the size of a bug. Let's climb down and rethink this. It's a duck! <laughs> <laughs> that is so a bunny. I love shadow puppets. With you guys here, this place isn't so scary. <gasps> A single scoop ice cream cone! It's so beautiful. I wish there was a way we could just break through this wall. I'll scan the mountain to see how thick it is. No chance. The mountain is way too thick. Wow, Angelina. Look at all the tunnels you dug. Nothing stops you guys from going where you want, huh? That's it! If we can't open up the entrance to the cave, we'll do what the ants do. And make our own tunnel. Let's combine it and design it. First, if we take the seat and steering wheel for my go-kart, then add not one, not two, but three pairs of robot arms. And top it all off with the giant ice cream cone from Sammy's store. Put it all together, and we've got our plan.
Customized. Rustified. The Antastic Drillbot 3000. Woo! Nice name, but can I just call it Andrew? How about Andrew 3000? Hmm. Sure, I can work with that. Great. Now let's get Sammy out of there. Let's dig. I mean, are you rusty? What's up? Not much. I just figured you might want to get out of here with a little help from a drill bot. Also known as Andrew 3000. Now let's get you out of here. Sweet. You guys want some ice cream too? Don't push the others, Billy Bob. I don't know why, but ever since I saw that robo ant you built, I've been craving a really big ice cream cone. Like the size of my beautiful sign. <gasps> Where's my sign? Right. About that. It's right here, Jack. We're coming! A new sign? Thanks, guys. You're the best. I had a backup made, because you can never have enough gigantic ice cream cones. <laughs> <laughs>